Alabama is thinking of passing a porn tax to make up for a budget shortfall that they're currently dealing with. Now, this porn tax would be a hefty, hefty one. In fact, uh, the Alabama House Ways and Means Committee passed the proposed porn tax in a 10 to 4 vote on Wednesday as lawmakers rush to fill a massive budget shortfall. In addition to any other applicable taxes, a 40% state excise tax will be levied on gross receipts from the sale, rental, or admission charges of pornographic material. It kind of goes to show you how out of touch politicians in Alabama are because no one's paying for porn. <laughs> right? Totally right. So this story is super relevant and super irrelevant. Uh, so uh, it's irrelevant in that, like these guys, they think they, are, uh -huh, right, we got, we're gonna impose our morals on them. No pouring on them, forty percent. Okay, yeah, except. Knucklehead, who's goes like I remember when I was a kid, there was a porn vending machine in a hotel. We used to ride across town and our bicycles, uh, risk our lives crossing the turnpike or the Route 18, I should say, to to buy a porn magazine from a vending machine. That was like a million years ago. <laughs> who's going and buying porn? Like the tiny, tiny percentage, right? So uh, it's unsurprising that the conservatives in Alabama have not heard of the internet. Hmm. Okay. Now, the reason why it is relevant is this is why I was worried about cigarette tax, mm -hmm. right? Now, I don't want anybody to smoke. I think it kills people, it causes cancer. I want to try to prevent it and and minimize it as much as humanly possible. But once we start down the road of judging people's habits and their morals or the things that they're doing right or the things that they're doing wrong, this is where that road ends up. Here's you start with cigarettes then you go to alcohol. Well, what do, you, what do you say your business, how much I drink? Then all of a sudden we're at porn yeah. and you're judging my morals. Yeah, and you're so, charging me more based on that. So here's the thing about cigarette taxes and the soda taxes, all of which I disagree with, right? Mm -hmm. They want people to stop doing things that are deemed unhealthy, right? Drinking a lot of soda, it's unhealthy. Smoking cigarettes, it's unhealthy. So it's a way of deterring people, which I understand. I don't agree with this type of strategy, but I understand the thinking behind it. This porn tax really angers me because it's not only a regressive tax, right? It's a tax that actually goes against something that is healthy for you, right? You should be spanking the salami. That's good for you. <laughs> I just recently read this um, interesting piece about all the different physical things that happen to you after you orgasm from, from masturbation, right? And it, it does wonderful things to your body and it really? feels really good. Yeah, so like, of course, when you're stressed out, it could help with that, but there are a bunch of other things. Unfortunately, I don't have this in front of me right now, so I can't list it for you. But it's a healthy, natural thing that we should all be doing, right? I, I'm afraid that some people in the audience might have already taken you up on your suggestion. <laughs> okay, so, uh, well, that's good to know. Yeah. But of course, they don't care about the health benefits, no. they're imposing their morals yes. on you. And, and and so that's what I'm afraid of. It starts with, well, I think it's unhealthy for you, which is also a judgment on your lifestyle to some degree, right? And then now all of a sudden, I think this is not good for you in another sense. It's immoral. Yes. Okay. And here's where we are. And by the way, the guy I thought conservatives hated taxes. Oh no, no, no. They love taxes when it's on you. Yeah. But, but they hated taxes when it's on the rich that fund their campaigns. So Republicans are not against taxes. Okay. They only want tax cuts for the rich, but whenever it's a tax cut that applies to the poor middle classes, uh, Barack Obama did with the Social Security uh, taxes, they're like, oh no, they were against it. Wait, I thought you wanted tax cuts. No, but that goes to the poor and the middle class, not to our rich friends. Now when you have a tax increase in Alabama, where I thought you guys were against taxing in Alabama, right? But now it's against poor and everybody's like, oh yeah. <laughs> That could be interpreted in the opposite direction, which apparently Anna tells me is healthy. Oh my God. <laughs>